Hello everyone, Pally Time here. I'm very sad to say it, but episode 18 and 19 of my Dark Souls playthrough uh, had an issue with the audio, uh, the game audio specifically being recorded on the capture card. This happened in the same day of my Heroes of the Storm video with Jim Brainer, where my graphics drivers died. I reinstalled my drivers and it switched around uh, my default audio devices. And unfortunately, I didn't notice until after I recorded two Dark Souls videos and another video that you guys aren't going to see either. Um, to resolve this problem, I'm going to put episode 18 and 19 together and then play the video with the game's soundtrack in the background because that's the only thing I could come up with. Uh, sorry, it sucks that when I make mistakes, thousands of people see the mistakes. I've just been kind of sitting here looking at this, trying to figure out what I wanted to do with it. I uh, hope you all understand, and we'll be back to normal in the next episode. Hello everyone, Pally Time here. Welcome back to Dark Souls 2. It is uh, 4.20 in the morning, blaze it, am I right? And no, no I'm not right. Um, and I'm going to get some recording done because I'm just wide awake. My sleep schedule has been atrocious lately. I slept for 15 hours, was awake for 32, and then slept for another 15. <laughs> so that's basically the situation we're in right now. Um, a lot of you have been raising concerns about this particular build in the comments of, of Davidius. And um, while I do appreciate all the feedback, I want to say just for out in the open, uh, this is like... This build is not meant to be competitive in any way. This build is not meant to, like, beat the end game with no problem. This build is simply an idea I had for making uh, a character that would uh, get a lot of healing. And I mean a lot of healing. From... From uh, unconventional means. And I know that uh, I could easily heal for more by using an Essence Flask right now. But, but that isn't what I wanted to do with the character. I wanted to be able to, to stay in combat, to drain life as enemies fall, to drain life when I attack them, and sustain that way. Uh, because it's fun. <laughs> it was, because it was an idea and I wanted to bring it to fruition. Um, so I know a lot of people have been, have been giving me feedback of what, uh, about what I've been doing, you know, uh, and I appreciate that, but that doesn't change the intent of the build. And the build isn't done yet, obviously. We we need... our armor is atrocious, our weapon's not fully upgraded, um, and I know we could do better with this weapon. Like, I know we could go out and uh, we could upgrade a, a different weapon and do significantly more damage than this one and and things like that. That's not what I'm trying to do. That's not what I'm trying to do at all. I'm trying to come up with a theme and have fun with that theme, which is something I've done a lot in the past. Um, if you guys are interested in going back and watching my old Dark Souls 1 content, I did several videos as Big Hat Logan, for instance. I made a Big Hat Logan character, and uh, I would play through the game as that character and just only use things that he would use. You know what I mean? Not because it was the most optimal way of playing through the game, but because it was fun. And it was a challenge, and it was a, a new way of approaching the same game that I've finished so, so, so many times before. Granted, I've never played this expansion before. Um, I also did the Bam Bam build, which was about... Uh, God, I don't even remember why. I couldn't even summarize my Bam Bam lore right now for you if I tried. Uh, what else did I do? I did a Smo and Ordstein playthrough with Ruokan. We played through the entire game, dressed up as the boss of Smo and Ornstein, only using their weapons, only using things that Smo and Ornstein would use. Uh, what I'm doing right now is looking for a ring in here. The, the plus one stamina regen ring is in here somewhere. Uh, I don't know where. I don't know where at all, actually. Uh, oh. Whoa, I got turned around. Holy crap. Um, yeah, I don't know where it is in here, so we're just kind of we're gonna kind of wander around and look for it. Uh, it will give us quite a bit of stamina regen, which is something that, that has been lacking. And uh, some people have suggested that I pick it up, and I agree with that decision. Uh, we should pick it up. 
Ouch. Come back. Don't know me like that. Is there another one? Oh. So apparently it's, um... I don't really know. I just know it's it's in here somewhere. Oh, God. How does it sit here? This looks helpful. This looks good. Oh, yeah. That look, that's looking like it's it. Here we go. How do you say that? Chloran Chloranthy ring? Chlor Motherfucker, I was trying to read. Where are you? You gotta pay for that shit. Now, one thing I am wondering, uh, I know infusing weapons is a thing, and we are going to be upping our vital, or excuse me, our faith quite a bit. Um, so I was wondering if I infuse the weapon with lightning to increase its damage that it does with faith, uh, would that get, would that nullify the healing effect that we have on the weapon right now, or would that still, like, could we just, could we heal every time we attack and, um, you know, get the benefit of it being an infused weapon? That's the kind of stuff I don't know. Uh, that I would like feedback on. But we are going to go ahead and, and equip that ring. What it's going to do is give us stamina back, which means... Uh, we we'll probably drop... I actually probably dropped a life ring, huh? Uh, which means that we um, can regenerate stamina with our shield up, which may not sound like a big deal, but for a, a build that's solely focused on blocking motherfuckers... It can be a pretty big deal, right? We are going to be making our way in here. We're going to um, try to take down the boss. We cleared the majority of this place in the last video. Uh, <laughs> I, I say that loosely, I guess. We died a lot in this place in the last video. And uh, now we're going to try to get to the boss. I am going to kill everything on the way just because we can. There's really no reason not to. Let's see. Look at our stamina bar as we are blocking now. That's a really, really big advantage for a tank character. Really, this ring is one of the best rings in the whole game for most builds. Uh, simply because being able to regenerate stamina means you can attack more, you can defend more, you can sprint more. You can do basically everything that every character does significantly more often. So I'm sure it's not that much of a stretch to think that, man, that must be a really good ring. Uh, I thought there was one more enemy. I guess he was behind me. So this should be a pretty big increase to our success. And you guys have been su suggesting that I get this for a while now. I know uh, in the original game, if I had uh, two bonfire aesthetics, I could redo the chariot boss. And then I would be able to get the plus three version of that or the plus two version of that. Oh, of course. Of course we were invaded. Of course. Let's do this. This might be fun. <laughs> oh, I need to hurry, though. Uh, come in! <laughs> that was worth that. That was worth it. <laughs> I know it didn't do much, but I had fun doing it. That's the important thing. Sit down, motherfucker. I'm in a really good mood tonight. Uh, it's really late. I probably should be sleeping. Um, I hope you guys understand that I record these ahead of schedule. But, so I could try to keep a steady flow. I know I'm not very good at keeping a steady release schedule, but... Uh... Come on. Ah, oh, he rolled. But um, I have a couple episodes ready to go prior to this one, basically. And that's usually the case. It's usually the case. Uh, my girlfriend, who's in charge of I've never really talked about the back end of my YouTube channel. Uh, Jessica, Vanilla Fox 27, um, is fully in charge of all the thumbnails and the release schedule of every video. She decides, you know, with my help, when everything goes out and everything like that. It really helps me out a lot because I was getting overwhelmed. I uh, do, I work full time for TGN Squadron. Like, uh, I'm employed full time. I'm a content coordinator. Or whatever my fucking title is now. I don't know. Oh, that's bad. 
Thank you! <laughs> that was like the best possible outcome imaginable. Uh, so, to help me get things done a little bit more efficiently, she asked if she could help out, and it's been a, it's been a really big help. But yeah, she's in charge of uh, doing all the thumbnails, organizing the playlists, releasing videos. That way I can just focus on making the videos. Do the stuff I'm kind of okay at sometimes. Are we seriously just playing Ring Around the Rosie with this too? I wonder how much of a problem this is going to become. Well, first of all, I, ro I walked just the wrong way. Okay, one down. Let's get some space here if I can. Sir. Oh, that works. Yeah. Oh, that'll be fine. Okay. How do I get back? <laughs> I go through here. I'll turn around. <laughs> Just in general, I feel like, um... I'm not really happy with how this character has been developing. I thought it was going to be... I thought it was going to generate a lot more power a lot faster. Now, this weapon isn't incredible or anything. But I thought it would be a little bit better. And that being said, it's not awful. Like, we just killed a guy in three swings. That's not bad. Um, I thought I would have more heals by this point. I really need to do more research into how to get those. Um, I know there's a f several heals over time. Several. And I only have one of them. Uh, there's one we can get from Pyromancy. Again, I'm not too sure how to do that. I need to look into that. And there's... What the fuck? And then there's another... Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Let's just... Stop locking on. We can go back to this room. I don't think they'll follow me to the room. I don't think so. There's a, there's a heal over time we can get from Pyromancy. And there's um, another heal over time we can get through one of the Covenants. But I think it's a ridiculous amount of items. So we may have to look into that. I don't know if... I don't know if it'll be worth the time commitment. This is nice, though. I'm, I, I like these late-night recordings. I'm usually just, like, super fucking chill. It's weird. I feel more like myself when my sleep schedule is, is just awful. Like, when I, when I can stay... Ouch. When I can stay up all night and work on content, that feels like... I, I know I can't yell because I still live at home and I would wake everybody up, but... Just... It, it feels like I'm actually myself. Feels way more natural, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Than when I'm recording during the day. Well, we killed everything. Uh, I'm not going to get that item. I'm not too worried about it. This boss uh, could be a bit of a... Could be a little challenging. Let's go ahead and jingle jingle our bell. Put our shield back on and walk in here. So this is the Smelter Demon. He has several phases, uh, and <laughs> they're going to be pretty hard, considering we don't roll. Um, he's going to ignite himself sooner or later. He has a big ass AoE he does, uh, and this is him charging up his weapon right now. I didn't bother hitting him because we would do reduced damage right now, basically. But as you can see, I'm taking a little bit of residual damage just by being next to all this fire that he's kind of hurling out of his midsection right now. Uh, so our heal is actually doing a pretty good job of nullifying this damage. He's going to stab himself again, which is going to power up his weapon one more time. And I believe this changes some of his actions. I don't quite remember. He, uh... I know at some point he gets a... Yeah, there it is. He gets an attack where he flies in the air and then explodes. I don't know if that's because of the third... Whoops! I don't know if that's because of the third... Uh, phase or not. Or if he just does it because he likes it. If he just likes how it feels. I don't know. 
Generally speaking, if you're getting overwhelmed on this boss, it's pretty easy just to walk away and heal. As I mess that up. <laughs> but again, the, the Butcher Knife dealing damage on this guy every time we attack is actually a pretty... It's pretty effective versus the damage over time he does. I don't hate it. I don't hate it one bit. I just like the, the pace that this character sets. There's hardly... I'm pinned in the corner. Uh, oh, this is bad. He, there, there's usually not a lot of urgency. We're just going to back up here. That'll force a certain attack. Let's wait for another attack animation. Or that. We'll just walk away and we'll heal. There's usually not a lot of urgency here, though, in these fights. With Ultima the Everlasting Knight. You simply live. And generally speaking, you know, of course, that's kind of what I intended. That's what I wanted. Of course, we die after I say that. <laughs> so the AoE does become a bit challenging. I don't think there's going to be... I don't think there's going to be an opportunity for me uh, to wave the chimes around. Uh, so, yeah. Nothing, nothing to do but get in there and try again. I should be able to run right in. I'm not going to take the time to kill all those enemies again. Should just be able to beeline it straight in the front door, hopefully. Uh, the reason I died last time I tried this is because there's just new enemies added into the equation. The guys on the bridge are actually pretty challenging to get around. Or at least I haven't found the route yet. Let's just go ahead and pop a rock candy. And ugh, try to walk right in. Two rock candies. So I'm going to lead this guy left and then go right. That yeah, went well. Lead this guy left. And then... Die. Okay. My god! It, ugh, there's so fucking many of them! Seriously! Holy shit, how am I still alive?! Motherfucker. Lock it. I'm going the fucking door. Jingle your fucking chimes. Oh, of course. Of course he was going to punish me for jingling my chimes. I forgot I had a crossbow equipped. I should probably get rid of that. Alright, round two, Mr. Smelter Demon. Round two. We could do it this time. We just need to make sure our health doesn't get as low as it was before. I'm going to take this opportunity to get the free damage in. It's like 84 damage, but that's 84 more damage we didn't have before. And to be honest, I wouldn't really be doing much in that time anyway. That hurt. Uh, let's go ahead and heal. He's going to hit me. He's going to hit me. He's going to hit me. He didn't hit me. Should have. You should have hit me, Mr. Smelter Demon. Definitely should have. Yeah. If you can't burst this guy down, though, I did mention earlier that we were fine, but it, if you can't burst him down, it does become a little bit of a problem. So I healed and rang my chime as he hit the third phase. This is going to be our last attempt our last chance to ring the chime anyway. So I went ahead and I did it. He's going to deal fire damage with all of his attacks. Oh, I did not expect that, actually. Fuck, 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 fuck. Which means um, we are going to be taking a little bit of damage through our shield even if we block. Which is a bit of a problem. That is a bit of a problem. Uh, so, at the next opportunity, I will eat one of these. 
and hopefully not be pelted in the face with a fucking sword. Okay. Okay, we're fine. Very good. He's a... Okay, I don't know what to look for with that stupid explosion thing. Blocked that. Blocked that somehow. Okay, we'll be back at full health in no time. Nice and easy. Here's an attack. Let's just get out of the way here. No reason to rush. We have 16 more life gems. Basically, if I can get in and attack every time he attacks, I'm pretty happy. Is he gonna explode? No. So attack. This one's an explosion, right? Yes. And then we attack. Bring it on, buddy. Bring it on, buddy. I know your tricks now. Kind of. Not really. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really know your tricks all that well. I'm trying. The good thing about this, this boss is that he has a pretty small weapon. So if you get out of his range, you're either gonna force a ranged attack, like a lunging attack, or he's just not gonna hit you. These fat, these fat rolls, though, am I right? These aren't even fat rolls. Because my encumbrance is over 70. These are just fucking rolls. He's going to explode. So we heal. Let's eat two, shall we? I'm going to race him. I'm dead because I fucking tried to race him. Oh, my God. What the fuck? What the fuck? There we go. Jeez. He hits hard in that third phase. Oh, good lord. Secret? Yeah, I was not expecting him to, to do my entire life bar in damage. That's ridiculous. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right, we don't have much healing. We don't have any healing items left, but uh, what we could do is go ahead and ring our bell. And you'll notice the Pursuer has returned. Have you noticed something, Pursuer? Do I have your shield, baby girl? Is it mine now? He has a lot more health this time. For some reason. Haven't quite figured that one out. Okay, so we can... We can dodge all of his attacks except for his shield bash, I guess. I can't parry him or anything. Because the shield doesn't have a parry. But we could just dance around him all day. Let our stamina come back. This ring is really helping a lot. I can't help but notice that uh, we don't have the regen effect ring going on right now. I guess it's because I rang the bell. I've never noticed that. Never noticed that. Wow, you hit hard. I'm not going to let him kill me. At least I thought, thought I wasn't. Ugh. Can you charge? Can you do that? Can I drink right next to you? Am I that ballsy? No, mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. But I guess I was that ballsy. I'm not healing anymore, huh? I keep falling for that shield thing. It's gonna get me killed. Come on, Pursuer. You could do better than this. You could do better than this, Pursuer. Do you even want your shield back? Do you even want your... Well, I guess he does have a shield. He's using one right now, but... That's besides the point. God. Here we go. That's a window. Not a very big one. Not a very big window. 
Oh, we staggered him. Huh. Yeah, our damage blows, man. Versus Mr. Pursuer here, anyway. I think we got him, though. Watch, he's gonna one-shot me now. <laughs> oh, come on. You know, by using this setup, the Ring of Blades plus one, it does force me to become better at the game. Because we're not zerging bosses down. It's very slow and methodical. We earn every single boss kill that we get. And I think there's something to be said about that. So I'm going to head back and level up. That's going to be it for today's video. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Hello, everyone. Pally Tim here. Welcome back to Dark Souls 2. Normally, there's uh, three enemies that are right here. One, Aloe Knight looking off in this direction. And then two over here on this bridge. Uh, I killed them all 12 times, or however many times it takes, and they stopped respawning. So just in case you're wondering why they're not there... Uh, that that would do it. Uh, I was trying to... I'm fucked, huh? I was trying to get their armor. And uh, did, didn't get a single piece. Not a single piece. <laughs> oh, welcome to Dark Souls. Welcome to Dark Souls. Alright, we'll just take it slow, bro. Take it slow, bro. Um, yeah, I was, uh, rendering the audio, exporting the audio and stuff, and while I was doing that, I was just sitting here killing some Alan Knights for really no reason. Fuck. There we go. Can he break that segment off, or is he just trying to, like... Is he just trying to be like, hey, look at me. Hitting things so hard. Uh-huh. Dude, you need to chill, for real. It's your problem. So, we are going to kill the last of the primal bosses today. Whatever they're called. I actually don't know what they're called. The four main bosses. We're going to kill the last of them today. And it's going to be easy, because he is actually incredibly, incredibly simple. Uh, I am going to have a look around this area, because... Well, that's not what I wanted at all. Why is that even an option? It's a very easy to kill, very easy way to kill that guy, I guess. So you just your head doesn't get squashed up there. Was that in the game before? I don't remember that. What's this way? There's no fucking way you landed that shot. Apparently I stepped on a pressure point that let lava fall down behind me. Hello, night gauntlets. Uh... So, I have to jump over these now, I guess? Oh, oh I didn't jump! I didn't jump! <laughs> uh, I don't like this area. I don't like this area one bit. I don't like this area one bit. Okay. Alright, let's... Let's just do this the way I always do, which is really easy. It's really straight to the point. I'm going to leave those souls over there because I don't need them. Uh, the way I always do this, there's a lot more enemies now. Holy shit. What the hell is by just running through here? It, it gets you to where you're going pretty quick. And then we can just ignore this guy and walk in eternity through that fog. Uh, I th we should be able to sippy cup right here. <laughs> well, at least not everything changes in the in the expansion DLC thing. At least we can still do this. 
I don't recall him being in here. Can you let me by? Can you let me by? Get, is your is your hitbox too big? Seriously? Your hitbox is just that big, huh? Oh, fuck me. What if we... <laughs> Okay, developers, so you didn't like people running through your zone in three seconds flat. All right, I see how it is. I see how it is. I'm gonna murder everything in here, and it's your fault, developers. Oh my god. <laughs> If I went flying off the side there, I don't think I could have taken it. Oh, no. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, you may be noticing that I'm able to roll around a little bit more. That's because I dropped my carrying weight under 70%. Not a permanent change to this armor or anything. Just wanted to give rolling a try again. Because it's been so long. Uh, <laughs> this area is significantly harder than it used to be. Can I open this? Or does this open from another? So this leads to like some PvP area I don't want to go to. Maybe we'll check it out when we're done with the box. Uh, but I'm telling you right now, that is one of my least favorite areas in the whole game, so I'm not, like, dying to go over there or anything. Um, we shouldn't need to pull the turtle guy. I don't think he should aggro. Apparently he does. The other one does. Okay, we can't stun the turtle. Uh, can't stagger him. So we need to run away for a moment. You know, we should, um, now that we've aggroed him, actually, if we're fast enough, this should work. I'm not going to bother to look. It looks good. Oh, I missed it by a fucking millisecond. Oh, my God. And now I got hit in the back with an arrow because I pulled an archer down. Great. Oh, fantastic. I'm surprised you guys could even fit through there. Honestly. Are you at the end? I don't think the other one can walk this way. I know I can't race him. I know I can't, and yet every time I try. Every fucking time I still try. It's like I'm, I don't learn anything. It's awful. The fuck was that? No, what was that? Other than a pile of garbage. Come on, man, you gotta cut me some slack. You can't just do that dance and then fall on your back. And expect me to be cool with it. Okay. Dude, this archer. I am so salty towards this archer. Oh my god. Go away and never come back. Seriously. There has to be an item on that, right? Why else would you be able to pull it down like that? There has to be an item there. Oh, that was a trap. Hey, you bastard. Oh, fucking shit, dick. <laughs> Alright, let's see what the archer has. It has to be something. Where's the second archer at, though? The one who shot the thing down. Where's that motherfucker? Okay. Go! Okay, so this leads to a ladder, huh? Well, this is fascinating. I've never done this. Is this new? Ambush ahead. More than just this one guy, or? That wasn't much of an ambush. 
Oh, I guess there is some archer some... Oh, that archer over there is helping out. And then there's a chest. Mimicry ahead. Really? Oh, come on! What the fuck kind of place is this turned into? Why do you have two weapons? What is, what is this helmet you have on? Is it a pig mask? What is this explosion thing you're doing? You are fascinating, Oliver the Collector. Whoa, that's a big stick. Where'd you get that? Oh, Oliver the Collector, I like you. I wish I didn't have to kill you. I would be your friend if you let me. Oliver the Collector. I really would be your friend, Oliver. You seem like a fascinating man. You. God, that was a hell of a shot, though. You can't be that mad. Is this really a mimic? It's not breathing. It doesn't have a lock on the front. Was it a mimic? Destructive great arrow. What a dick! Oh. Oh, there's an item. You know, I actually have no idea where this leads. No idea whatsoever. So this is just a pool of water. And then... <laughs> uh, what the fuck is this? Oh, what the... Seriously, what the hell? What the hell is this? Okay. Alright. Alright. Please, none of you pull out your sword. Seriously. I don't want to deal with that. So where does this bring me? Oh, man. Are these water jugs? Okay. We're going to do that just to be on the safe side. Was this always here? I've never done this. This is interesting. Don't give up, skeleton. The covetous gold serpent ring. Doesn't that give us more souls? Yes. Oh, fallen enemies, enemies are more likely to drop items. I see. There's a ring like that with a very similar design that, um... Oh, shit! Okay, kill it. Uh, please tell me I have... Oh, thank God. Thank God. I'm not using my knuckle thing, am I? Okay, that's a problem. We need to bring that weapon back. There we go. Or that ring back. Why, hello there, handsome. <laughs> uh huh. -huh. You want to come out here? Oh, I don't know where the stairs are. Almost walked right off. Look at that roll, though. What you know about that? Look, I'm learning, see? <laughs> kind of. 
<laughs> I'm kind of learning. Alright. Let us continue, shall we? That was quite the adventure. I've never done any of that. It's very interesting. This is just gonna raise this guillotine thing. Oh, fuck you. Oh, f seriously, fuck you. I am so glad that I dropped that weight from my equipment so I can actually do this. So glad. I would have been so angry to fight that guy in that little area. Okay, let's move here. And then we move here. I thought! Uh, 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 that, that one made me angry. That, that death made me angry. Alright, take two. We could just come right up here and there should be another bonfire. At least there was in the original game. Like I said, I don't think the bonfire areas have changed. And this lever, by pulling that lever, we remove all of this bullshit fire that we were just dealing with. Isn't that nice and convenient? Oh yes. Oh yes. All right, let's go see what that item was. I don't. I actually don't know. It shouldn't. It shouldn't be too important. If I don't know what it was already, then it must not be too important. It is. The lightning short bow. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. It's just a bow. Just do your attacks. Let's get this over with. Let's do this dance. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm more irritated fighting those guys than I am challenged. You know what I mean? Phantom required ahead and then hurrah for victory. Why is there a phantom required? I will go ahead and get a human form just to add in that extra little bit of HP. Are you ready? Don't tell me they actually made this boss hard. This boss used to be the most brain dead piece of shit. It seriously, did nothing. Alright, well, the area is still the same. Lava all over the place. If you make a wrong step, you're probably gonna die. Uh, he does a very slow fire breath. That you can see there. He's gonna come a little bit closer. And, uh, well, here's the flame breath again. At some point, he's gonna come closer and slam his hands against the thing. And then we just do a really easy roll out of the way and hit him in the hand. And that's the whole fucking fight. I think you've seen nearly... Oh my god. I just took the... I put the controller down and threw my arms in the air. Did I really just die? On that boss. Oh, I'm losing it. I'm, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. Just... Oh, did you bring a healing item to this fight? Well, con congratulations, you won. Gonna slam again. Holy fucking shit, I died again. Oh my god. I am so mad. I am so mad right now. Not even like, not even angry. Not even frustrated. Just mad. Unbelievable. Just do your shit. Just 
just do your fucking shit, man. You do what you gotta do. I'm angry. I'm not gonna lose again. I wish I had more stamina. Was that it? You're just slamming it down so I can cut it? Okay. This is a swipe. Are you just gonna let me cut it again? Okay. Here we go. We just get- Oh! I'm locked off again! Then we get out of the fire, we come back. This is this explodey AoE thing. Oh, into a swipe? Those immunity frames, though. What do you know about that 70% weight? What do you know about it? Okay. I rolled a little too soon there. Let's just need one of these. We'll be fine. Alright, give her the fire. Let me kill you. It's gonna take one more attack from him, and then I got him. Of course he's gonna breathe fire. Of course, of course he is. Why wouldn't he? Of course... Oh my god, I thought it fell in again. Of course he's gonna breathe fire. I probably could have ended it right there. There was an opening. You gonna slam? Got it. Got it. I'm embarrassed it took that many tries. I'm legitly embarrassed. I could edit it to seem like it only took me one try. <laughs> it take all this audio out. Be wary of head. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fine work. Visions of victory. What's going on here? Why are there so many people dead? Why are there so many damn people dead? This is another one of the DLCs. Uh, we should be able to enter. I don't think we could do anything inside. But we could at least enter the DLC. I don't know what's inside, though. Uh, the sign was written from a being. So we can't read any of this. I don't think we can interact with anything here. So we just have to leave. Uh, the DLC opens... When does the DLC open? It's not after the last boss, is it? I don't think it is. I think we could do those before. But, sadly, that is going to be it for today's video, guys. Uh, we should get a little pep talk from our friend. What? What? Hello?